Mm. Mm. Oh. Oh, it's recording? Excuse me. Woo. Y'all, I'm, I'm busted. I'm enjoying me some coconut popsicle. Um, that is like my little sweet treat. 130 calories, I think. Um, and it's yummy. So, anyways, I'm here to do my five faves, five tags. Um, that um, less of Sarah tagged me in. Thank you to my Canadian sister. Yes, Sarah, you go, girl, with your bad self over there in the on the East Coast. Um, even though we're both Canadians, like you are, like on the opposite end of the spectrum. You know what I mean? Way over there, and I'm way on the West Coast. But no, whenever you want to come visit. You have a friend here, okay? Anyways, so I'm going to be doing that tag. I'm going to try and make it quick, okay? So what is more important to weight loss? For me, it's it's definitely diet and exercise, eating and exercise. And I know Sarah touched on the mental part of it. But for me, yeah, when, once you got your mind right, which she she's correct, it's definitely the most important you got to eat properly. It's calories in and calories out. So whatever you're putting in your mouth, you got to be more, you got to be burning off more than that to, to lose the weight. So that is definitely what has worked for me. And, um, I've proved it in the year and a half that I've been doing this. Um, what is your protein of choice? You know, I had some in here. It's empty now, but because my kids saw it on the table while I was getting ready to do this video, and they just finished it all. So, but my, my, my protein of choice is definitely the Deli, the Deli Fresh by Oscar Mayer, the Mystique um, Turkey Breast. It is 50 calories per serving, and it's a two ounce serving, and it's nine proteins and one gram of fat. You can't, you cannot beat that, okay? It's delicious. I love the flavor of this. Um, it's 20% of your sodium for the day um but i don't really too watch sodium too too much um so it's my first choice um or not even my first choice i think this would be my first choice my body fortress um whey isolate um i love this because it's the calories are pretty good it's 130 calories for 30 grams of protein you cannot beat that so um i have this every day um i usually take it to work in the night with me and I'll sip on that um, with a banana or half a banana and some PB2. Before I got my PB2, I was just having peanut butter and it was such high calories. So I'm glad for my PB2. I'm not a huge fan of the PB2. Um, I think it's overrated, but that's my opinion. Um, but it does add a little flavor and plus you're still getting a little bit of protein in there and stuff. So... That's what I've been doing. Actually, last night was the first time I had it in a long time without anything in it, just water and um, the powder. And it was it was tolerable. It was, it was good. And that's what I like about it. It tastes good. It's good amount of calories, 130 calories per serving. And 30 grams of protein. Can't beat that. So, um, how, do I, how do you handle a stall? I'm with Kel on this one. Um, I don't believe in stalls. I think that if you do what you're supposed to do, your body will respond um, accordingly. So if you're not doing what you're supposed to do, your body will respond or not respond. <laughs> um, so um, for me, I've shown that when I was working for that first year, I was just in the gym constantly. I was eating proper. I was on point. The weight was coming off tremendously. Like I lost 200 pounds in a year, you know, and once I got comfortable and I stopped going to the gym, I stopped working out consistently, the weight slowed down. In the last six months, I've only lost 30, 30, it's fluctuating, 36, 37, 38 pounds, depends on the week, um, in, in the last six months, which is still not bad, like, really, can I really complain? No. But comp when I compare it to um, my first year, definitely um, I can work harder. Um, I have proved to myself that if I work hard, the weight will come off. If I don't work, the weight stays the same or it goes up a bit. So we're trying to get it down, but um, I'm going to leave that there. 
Okay, that's another whole another video. Um, what are your plans after reaching your goal? I'm close to my goal. I just want to see Wonderland and I'm thinking maybe I'll get to 190. After I get to Wonderland, I'll work to 190 and see how I feel. Um, honestly, right now, I feel like I'm done. Um, but I just want to see Wonderland. I'm sorry. I just, I do. I'm, I just want to see one be the first digit on my, on my scale. Um, I never dreamed in my whole life that I could get, I could get to where I am today. So, um, yeah, but plans, my plans are, I'm planning on doing my plastic surgery. So that's my plans. I'm halfway there in my savings for my plastic surgery. Um, I'm saving hardcore. I'm getting my debt in order and everything so that um, I can have my lower body lift and my tatas done. See, there, oh my goodness. There's so, there's no fat in my breast. It's not even funny that when I push my bra up, hold on, let me, I, have to, I have to show you guys. This is so funny. Nothing move like it. Yeah, it, it does move, but there's no, there's no hump. I don't get a hump up there because there, there's no fat in my bosoms. Anyways, um, so yeah, my plastics is definitely in the works for when I reach to my goal. Um, and my goal is just around the corner, guys. Like. I'm excited. Um, what's your favorite thing about the weight loss surgery community? Um, I, you guys, I've talked about this before, and it's the fact that I don't know anybody in my circle that I see on a day face-to-face -face basis in Canada here, um, in Vancouver to be exact, that has had surgery. I am the only one that I know in person um, that has had surgery, you know, I'm sure there's lots of people here that has weight loss surgery, but I don't know any of them But so if anybody's ever if you ever stumble up on my video and you live in Vancouver, please introduce yourself Even if you live in Seattle, I go to Seattle all the time um, I would love to know and you know Strike up a friendship with somebody who is out here who is in my circle that I can go to the gym with go for walks with go for coffee call um and just have a connection with because it is it gets really really lonely you know people see you and they're like oh you look amazing you've lost so much weight but they don't they don't really understand the struggles the day-to-day -day struggles so for me coming on YouTube has been such awesome such an awesome therapy support group whatever you want to call it that I have you guys that I, that I can just be like do you understand or can you relate? Is there anybody out there? You know, and I know that there's somebody's gonna say, yes, I totally got what you're saying or yeah, me too, you know? So this community means the world to me. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, you know? My whole family is a small family, you know what I mean? Everybody is slim to average, you know what I mean? And um, I, in my last video, I took a picture with my brother and I know some of y'all thinking it was my man. No, it ain't my man. It's my brother. <laughs> and um, I'm I'm smaller than my brother. You know that has never been before. You know what I mean. So that's exciting. Um, what else? Um, but yeah, this community definitely um, the best thing. And if you guys, I mean, I've, I have I have a lot of subscribers that are not making videos and just encourage you guys just to get out here and make some videos come out and play with us let us know who you are because I know for me it means a lot to have a face to see a face to see some personality behind who's leaving you um, comments and stuff you know and I just want to thank you guys for always encouraging me and for giving me support and love and everything um, I never thought this would have been a 10 minute video but it is um, I have another video coming up soon. I'm going to be doing a skin video maybe later tonight and do it, uploading tomorrow. And I'm going to bear all, guys. Well, not all, all, but I'm going to bear, show you what I'm working with because I know somebody can relate. So I just want to thank Sarah again. Thanks for tagging me in this video and bringing me out because, you know, I've been kind of quiet lately. So <laughs> anyways, make sure you guys are getting your protein in. Make sure you guys are getting your exercising, because I sure am. Um, did a boot camp class um, a few days ago, and it kicked my booty. 
So I'm going to be going back once a week to that boot camp class. Not boot camp. No, it was a kick cardio kickbox. Yes, cardio kickbox class. And it was awesome. So I'll see you guys in the next video. And man, I'm hoping that I'm going to see you guys in Wonderland. I don't know. Maybe, you know, that would be nice. Um, I'll see you guys smaller, though, definitely. Bye. Oh, let's get back to it. Mm.